Hey guys, it's A True Gamer, and welcome to the third episode of Taming the Bosses. I've gotten three more pets since last time to show you, so let's go ahead and dive right into the episode. To recap, on screen now you'll see all the boss pets I've gotten up to this point, along with their kill count totals. And here we go with the new additions. Boom! There's the Corrupted Ascension Signet 3 from Legio Tertius, which unlocks the Legio Tertiolus pet. I managed to get the drop without any thresholds at only 691 legions kills, so pretty lucky there. Next up, after a while at the fight kiln, but not too long, I managed to obtain the Volcanic Shard drop from Huracan. Anyone who has hunted down this pet will understand the great feeling of relief when your character finally bends over to accept the, uh, to, to get the drop, so that you no longer have to grind out the kiln to get the pet. Y yep, yeah, yeah, that's, that's where I was going with that, yep. Shrimpy! Aw, yeah. I obtained this little guy on my 128th Harakin kill. Alright, as you can probably guess from the environment I'm in, I was able to snag myself a Krar Jr. pet from the Nemi Forest. So now my little Tuzzy has a friend! Come on, Jagex! Release a Cormaz pet so they can become a trio! I was actually pretty lucky here and probably only spent around 25 to 30 hours in total camping out in the forest for the pet. So now on screen we have my updated boss pet list with the kill count totals I obtained them on. And with that we'll go ahead and end episode 3 of Taming the Bosses. Good luck to you all if you're hunting down any boss pets as well. And let me know down in the comments which ones you're going for next. Anyway guys, as always, thank you for watching and I'll catch you next time.